organizers accomplished this and what they're hoping to get out of it. Sean? Well, that's right, Colleen. This was a very informal. Several mosques opened their doors to the public today for Central Ohio's first ever Open Mosque Day. NBC4 Sean Lanier is joining us live now from one of them with more on how organizers accomplished this and what they're hoping to get out of it. Sean? Well, that's right, Colleen. This was a very informal event that they were holding. They just wanted people of different faiths to grab some food and come together to talk religion. Now, I spoke with a couple that came here today, and they said this was not only a great opportunity for them, but for all of Central Ohio. Hear about Muslims from Muslims. It was a time for the people of Columbus to get to know their Muslim neighbors on a more personal level. Sometimes you have to cross that, you know, comfort zone or comfort barrier and then uh, go across that to learn something new. And that's exactly what this event is about. That's exactly what Kelly and Evan Jasper did. Their family took an opportunity during the first ever Central Ohio Open Mosque Day to open their eyes and their hearts to another faith. Both of us have known, you know, sort of academically about Islam and, you know, the beliefs of Islam. But this is more of a chance to make it personal and see how, you know, what it looks like in people's real lives. They had questions and even stayed during one of the prayers. <coughs> Kelly says what's most important about this opportunity is exposing her children to something new and different. The joyous sort of intermingling of these kids is what really it's all about. She feels this could truly be a way to tear down walls of hate. Anything that you think about a group of people can fall apart as soon as you know an individual. And while this open mosque day is over, the president here at this mosque behind me, he tells me that their mosques are always open to anyone of any faith at any time. So you can always walk in and ask any questions. He said that they, he does hope that they can do more of these open mosque days in the future. Local for you in Columbus, Sean Lanier, NBC4. Thank you, Sean.